Hey guys, so today we're going to be taking a look at the LR Super Saiyan Goku, Vegeta, and Trunks Rainbowed and Max Lynx. So we're good to go. Full potential unlocked for the character here. Um, in terms of my build, I did end up going, again, a mixture of additional and dodge. I think that for this character, um, of course, they are more of an offensive unit than they are a def defensive unit. And because of that, you would most likely want to take advantage of their offensive side of things. But they already have essentially everything they need already built into their passive, right? They're getting a bunch of additionals. They're effective against all types. And then on the turn where they're using their active skill, they're already critting. So you don't really need to supplement that with additional offensive stuff in the hidden system because it's already covered, right? You already have it all covered already. Um, the only thing I would say is because they have so many additionals built into their passive already, depending on how many orbs you get, but like you don't need to go a ton of additional. I went 14 additional because I just wanted to make sure that we're basically always going to get the hidden potential system additional. Um, but you could even go less than four. Like you, you could go like 11 or, or 12 or something like that. And then I just put the remaining points into uh, dodge. So I have 19 dodge here. Um, and then I wanted to also make sure that I gave them some extra attack, both in the gold slot and the bronze slot because that should help them uh, get more value out of their great attack stacks from their 18 key uh, and 12 key super attack effects, which again will factor directly into the active skill damage. So uh, they should be doing uh, quite a lot of damage here. So uh, we're going to be using the same team with them. Now, I actually did go through and scan the Super Saiyan category one more time after I recorded the 55% showcase. And there were two characters that jumped out at me as potential candidates for this team after they get an easy A. I don't know when it's going to be, but it's the GT, Super Saiyan, Vegeta, and Goku, right? They're Rainbow Orb Changers and Super Saiyans. So, I mean, they would fit perfectly on this team here. It's just a matter of when are they going to get their easy A. So if they actually get one relatively soon, they'd be crazy additions to this team here um, because this LR already does do type orb changing, into orb changing. If you pair that up with a Rainbow Orb Changing character, this, this character is going to be ridiculous. I mean, they already are pretty ridiculous, but that would make it even more ridiculous. So we're going to jump into the Metal Cooler Core stage of the red zone here. Now, obviously, Metal Cooler Core has type advantage over this character, but I feel like this character is just so offensively crazy that if we get a good turn with them on the turn prior to going into the Metal Cooler Core, like we could just active skill and kill him instantly. I feel like we could actually do that. Um, I'm bringing a Senzu Bean because the Metal Cooler Core can seal and lock and stuff like that. I think, I think, it's, actually, I think it's just sealing. Um, and then besides that, again, this is the same exact team I used for the 55% video. The friend is also Rainbow Link level 10. He has a similar build to mine. He went with a defensive bronze skill orb instead of an uh, offensive one. But let's just go ahead and jump in here and uh, we'll see how we do. Now, if this ends up going by super fast, which is a high chance it does we might jump into another event here but uh, to start things off with let's start with this rotations actually are pretty damn good right away so we're looking good already here Okay, so we have their entrance buff. They're getting the effective against all types plus the 30% damage reduction for the first five turns. Um, okay, so what I'll do here is I'll leave STR Goku on rotation, I think. Because they, they share a lot of links together, right? Yeah, everything except for experienced fighters is what they share here. Does Bardock have experienced fighters? He does not. Okay. Yeah, so we'll leave things like this. I mean, this is a lot. Right away, this is a lot of support for them. They're getting the defensive support and key support from the Goku, and then they're getting the key support and uh, both stat supports from Bardock. So right away here, we're starting at 327. Remember, this is without their 18 key defensive stack here. Now, unfortunately, the orbs <laughs> orbs did not work out really well for us. Maybe we'll just do this instead, actually. If we do this, we should be able to get a better amount of orbs. I, you at least want to get six orbs with this character. Um, and that will allow them to get uh, two additional supers from their pass instead of one. It's a pretty big difference. I think trying to aim for the nine every turn is a bit unrealistic. I mean, you're, not, you're not always going to get nine orbs. But um, I think at least six is uh, what you would try and hope for. So I think we'll do this, actually. Um, I wanted to put STR Goku in the middle because he's going to get hit more times there to build up. But this is fine. 
All right, and then we're gonna be able to get damn where yeah we're one short. Uh, it, I mean, it's still still good enough, so we'll let's we'll grab that. Um, and then Bardock will just do this. We'll drop the green orbs for next turn. Yeah, that's gonna. I think that actually is gonna be nine orbs for the other the other LR and the other rotation. Alrighty, so Goku's gonna get the additional super guaranteed. That's from 24 key. Give him a bit of extra defense. This guy's certainly a good asset for this fight, at least for the second phase, because he's going to have type advantage. Plus, he should be fully built up by the time we get to that phase anyway. All right. He's going to start getting built up here. He is going to be super right away, but I'm not really too concerned. Yeah, it's not horrible. I do troll damage there. All right, yeah, right away, we're starting with 16 million. We have the physical Bardock support here. Let's see how many supers we can get. It's not really that big of a deal on this turn because we're still going to be fighting another turn of this guy um, on turn three. But starting from next turn, it's really going to matter how many supers we get with each of these characters. All right, so this is their second super. There's a normal one more. And they do get the hidden potential system additional. Yeah, so this three super. Honestly, if you get three supers in a turn, you're good to go. Uh, that's really all you can ask for. Um, sure, obviously four is really nice. And then, of course, the god turn where you get the five supers. I mean, it's, that's just going to be so uncommon. <laughs> it's going to be so rare to see that. But if you get that, I mean, you're, you you probably win. I mean, if you, get the, if you get a turn where this character is supering five times, you've probably moved on to the next phase at that point. All right, Bardock should be able to eat this okay. Type advantage plus defense was raised by getting hit there. Yeah, that's nothing to Bardock. Okay, so we have the double type orb changing here. Oh, it's a lot of int orbs. Okay, I mean, how do we want to do this? Do I want to rotate off God Goku? Because the thing here is like, actually, I think I'm going to do this. And the reason is because I want to give all these int orbs to the int LR. And Tech God, Tech, um, Tech Super Saiyan Goku, if he gets this one orb here, he's going to get hit three times to guaranteed get his stack. And this is the reason why I didn't put dodge on my Tech Goku, is because in a situation like this, if we were to grab this, which we're doing, so let's grab this. If we were to do this, and if my Tech Goku had dodge, there's a chance we would actually miss the 18 key stack here if we dodge one of the attacks in the front which would not be good. So this sets up a real, I mean, this is just, this is 13, or this is a full heal, isn't it? I mean, their defense is not super high here because there's no support. Plus uh, they haven't gotten their stack yet, but there should still be a lot of healing. And then God Goku should still be able to get six. Yeah, seven, that's good. All right. Yeah, so that's fine. Tech uh, Goku here should be good enough to be our slot one unit going into the core. All right, so he will get his stack there. He's going to get a lot of extra key from getting hit too, which is nice. Don't have to worry about his key from now on. All right, so these guys, now it's going to matter how many supers we get um, with them because this is going to carry over to the metal cooler core first turn. All right, there's one. Two, okay. At least one more would be ideal here. Come on, give us one more. Nice. Okay, they, this could be the legendary five turn, five uh, super turn here. All right, this is the third super. One more. Can they give us a, a quad? Oh my god, wait. One more? Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Give us the legendary five. Oh, do you guys understand how ridiculous turn four is going to be? One more, please. Oh my god, we got it! <laughs> Do you guys understand how absurd turn five is? Or turn, yeah, turn. Is it turn five? No, it's turn four. How ridiculous turn four is gonna be? We got four stack. We got five stacks with them, and we're gonna have Bardock support. He's dead. We're gonna. We're actually gonna one turn him. I think we're gonna one turn the core. 
Like, literally. I think he's going to get killed in one turn. This is... <laughs> Damn, I'm actually kind of annoyed this is the friend and not mine, because mine has the extra attack skill orb on. I think it actually would make a difference. I mean, to be fair, this guy does have a silver and gold skill orb that has uh, attack on it, but... Okay, I want to just check something. My, my character should have higher attack. 18, 5, 5, 5, and then his has... Oh, no, he actually has more than me. Oh, he's using... Oh, you know why? It's because he's using the... Um, the metal cooler versus... Go like, he's using the cooler and... Say, like, the Wicked Bloodline... Pri what does it call? Like, the Pride of the Wicked Bloodline or something event? That's what this is. This, yeah, this is a crazy skill orb. This is 900 attack and five crit. And then this is also from that as well, 200 attack there. Yeah, okay, now I understand. Okay, I mean, that's good. I I'm happy the friend got the, uh, the, the the quintuple super. He also has, se the dude, if only this was attack. Can you imagine how much damage he would do next turn? I mean, it's still good that he's giving defense, I guess, but. All right, so my, uh, we have full links in slot two. Uh, basically 450,000 defense here. Uh, I'm just going to leave future Gohan here, I guess. I don't really see a reason to leave this Goku on rotation at this point. We'll just leave future Gohan here. And then we'll prepare this guy as well. Because I don't think the orbs carry over. Like if I, if I, if I were to say I want to save these into orbs for next turn, because technically the boss is phasing into a new phase, I don't think these are actually going to carry over. So you might as well just grab them here. And then, of course, we're going to save the active skill. Although, <laughs> this boss might actually be dead next turn. Like, it's actually going to be insane how much damage we deal. All right, this is going to do some damage. We have not attacked the future Gohan, but it shouldn't be that bad. Yeah, it's not that bad. Okay, I, guys, I don't know if you're ready for this next turn. <laughs> <laughs> I don't I don't know if you're ready for this ridiculous onslaught next turn. The active skill is actually gonna hit for like 25 to 30 million damage, I think. <laughs> it's gonna be so stupid. Yeah, look at this 18 million from this character. 18 million no support. Right? I think yeah, there's no, I mean no offensive support at least. Okay, there's a double super. Because remember, they have the attack stats, um, well, the attack stacks carrying over from the prior turn when they supered. I think it was twice or th three times, I think. All right, one more super, go. Damn normal. Okay, I mean, their normals are still doing a lot of damage because they're still super effective against all types. All right, this Goku at this point should be fairly good to go against the super. Okay, no super. All right, boys, <laughs> here we go. The metal cooler core, you say? <laughs> yeah, I was ready for that. What a jackass, dude. God, go away. Yeah, we prepared for this. Okay, 439,000 defense. We have everything except for experienced fighters activated here. Um, what's like the best way to get the orbs to fall? Is it probably it's probably this. I don't know actually. Well, regardless, we're definitely popping the active skill. This dude, this is gonna hit like an actual atomic bomb. Let's go. Oh, just 32 million? That's it? Half your HP just instantly disintegrated? All right, so now we're up to, oh, just a million defense. You know, still got the 30% uh, damage reduction as well. Um, One, two, three, four, five. I actually think this is the best way to do this. This guarantees we get six orbs because this will drop the uh, physical orb. I think this is the best play here is to do this. 
Yep, and then... Oh, okay, almost got bamboozled there. That's actually not what I intended to have happen. I didn't realize it would take the... Uh, I guess that makes sense that it would prioritize the Intorbs there. But we still get six from this, so uh, we'll go ahead and do that. Unfortunately, we aren't going to get max key. But I don't think it matters. Let's just do this. All right, and um, I think we just kill him. I think it's done. Just one turn this guy like, it, like he's a story mode boss. This is going to hurt because we haven't gotten hit yet, but we're, we're not going to get one shot by this, so whatever. Yeah, it still hurts, but we're fine. All right, boys. Show him who's boss. 10 million by this guy's pretty good. Show him who's boss. Take him out. End his existence. I don't really think we need to show anything else. I think we're good. <laughs> I think this, I think this uh, was a pretty good showcase here. Almost 20 If they were at 24k, they'd be over 20 million here. Guaranteed crits, by the way. So, I mean, this is over. He's dead. Even if we do only normals, he's dead, I think. Like, this normal's an 8 million tax at normal. <laughs> Their normal attack is not that much different than the super. The super is 13.9, and the normal was 8 million. That's not that big of a... It's not even, it's not even two times as high as the normal. And keep in mind, they could have still done, what, one more after this? Uh, because we only got six orbs. So... Yeah, um, I, I really don't think we need to go into another state. I think we showed everything we needed to show here. By the way, don't forget, on this turn, they had a million defense with 30% damage reduction. And then on top of that, when they were going to do their 18 key super, they were going to get another great stack for three turns. So it's not like this character is a glass cannon that absolutely cannot take a hit. This character was like at what? 1.2 million defense with 30% damage reduction for the attack? That's respectable, man. <laughs> on top of the fact that they literally did like 60 million damage worth of attacks in this might be 70 million 80 million i don't know what it was it was ridiculous the turn when this character uses their active skill like there's really nothing that can survive especially when you get the five supers before <laughs> they just hit for it was a 32 million damage active skill so i think we're gonna leave the showcase there again not really much else we need to show that was pretty much everything that uh everything went according to plan there honestly so let me know down below what you guys think of Rainbow Max Link's LR Super Saiyan Goku Vegeta and Trunks. Hope you guys enjoyed, and I will see you all in the next one.